Now I've heard that they went from shooting this directly into Doogie. Was the fact that Milo was in this, does that have any bearing on him getting a role in season two of Doogie? Well, yes, 100%. Because um, the plan was to shoot this movie between seasons one and two. And we saw Milo together uh, with Peyton when he read for Ben. And I immediately thought, they're amazing. Like, I, I feel like they are the new Tom Hanks and Meg Ryan. So I said to Courtney Kang, we need to get Milo into season two. Very, for the first time to Dookie. Yes. Right back to back. Um, yes. Tell me how that, that came about. It came about because of Prom Pact. Uh, Melvin Marr is a producer on both projects, and um, you know I was casting this, and me and Peyton hit it off so well, and I think he was like, why don't we get you on Doogie and see if it works out. It worked out. Hopefully, when you guys watch it, you like it, both Prom Pact and Doogie. But I love working with Peyton. I hope to work with her a lot in the future. She's very professional. She's a really fun person to be around. She makes me a better person, so big Peyton Lee fan. Cool. Hi. I know this is kind of like a Doogie slash Prom Pact reunion Yeah, for you. it is. And uh, you went right from this project to that project. What was that transition like? It was, it was a lot. It was a busy year for me, but I mean, when you do what you love, you never work a day in your life. So it was so much fun. Um, it was so exciting. Milo actually somehow ended up following me there and weaseling his way into the show. But um, no, it was it was amazing. We had so much fun and I just feel so lucky to be a part of all the things that I get to be part of. Peyton and Milo are here and yeah, they're both, yeah. both in season two. Yeah. Um, did they talk a lot about their experience on Prom Pack since they had just come to season two from this? So here's the thing that's really interesting, right? Is we had filmed season one. So me and Peyton had our had an amazing friendship out of that. And then we start, they started filming Prom Pack. So then Peyton and, and Milo have a great friendship. So then when we got there, it kind of was one of these like, not nervousness, but it was one of those like, oh man, I hope all three of us, and as soon as we all three of us kicked it, it was just like, me and Milo almost, actually Peyton will probably got a little upset because me and Milo became such good friends. So Milo now became, me and him have our own friendship, all of us have our own friendships, and then when we're together, it's just this beautiful, fun friendship together. So it's really great. Seeing my boy right now, we're giving a big hug. We're doing an interview collab, is what we call this, an interview collab. Uh, uh, what's it like uh, being here and having heard about their experiences making Prom Pack while you were making season two? Well, Peyton is like my little sister. I mean, she plays my little sister on the show, but she does feel like my little sister in real life, so I'm so proud. Um, and Milo is so cool. Uh, in in the short amount of time that we got to hang out while filming, we got really close, and I love the guy. Um, and I'm so excited to see them. I've heard a lot about the movie. I've seen some behind the scenes stuff, and it looks beautiful. So I'm just really excited to see it all on the big screen. Cool. Now season two is gonna be coming out soon on Disney Plus. Yes. Um, what are you most excited for fans of the show to see with your character? Um, well, I think they'll like to see how um, Brian Patrick is exploring um, parts of growing up, and he tries out like new and different things when he's growing up and stuff. Cool. Um, what are you most looking forward to about Prom Pact? Have you heard a lot about it from from Peyton and Milo since they? No. Well, I just know that she fin finished this like in Canada and the next day got on a flight to Hawaii to start the second season of Doogie so when she came she was a little sad because she she made this really lovely family on this movie and I got to hear about the family not she didn't tell me too much about what she did in the movie or anything like that she just had a blast with everybody on it so so yeah and I'm sure it reads that way when you watch the movie so I can't wait to see it and see like all the you know what all the fuss was about <laughs> yeah, yeah.